Happy Palm Sunday everyone, welcome once again to my YouTube channel, I am Amanda Oimitsu of the Mandi and Family YouTube channel, a YouTuber based in Worry, precisely in Ikakwame here in the other state of Nigeria. How are you guys doing? I hope you're doing well. So this is me checking out my outfit for today being Palm Sunday. Please enjoy the rest of the video as I come back to give more explanation. God bless you. <music> Color of the day, red, palm fronts, all are used on Palm Sunday. Please keep watching. Happy Palm Sunday. The minister comes around to sing songs of adoration to God Almighty for safe arrival into Palm Sunday 2023. Please keep watching, don't go nowhere. Thank you. <laughs> So Palm Sunday is the beginning of the Passion Week. It precedes the Holy Week. Palm Sunday is a Sunday that, you know, depicts Jesus' triumphant entry into Jerusalem. A lot of things, you know, are usually done on this particular day just to commemorate that day and all that happened in Jerusalem. Please keep watching. You're not going to miss out on anything. Thank you. God bless you. Even the season of that time, they did not have the kind of pandemonium of welcome that was given to Jesus that riding on earth. Keep the basis. Enter into the community with the convoy of chariot of us. Another unique thing that happens on this particular Sunday for us is the color that we use. Now, red is used on this particular day to symbolize the blood of Jesus. Remember, Palm Sunday precedes Easter, and Easter is the resurrection of Christ from the dead. After he died, on the third day he rose again, right? So we use red to signify everything, the passion, everything that Jesus went through, particularly his blood on this particular day of palm sunday another thing worthy of note is the palm ferns that you see the minister holding right it was used on the day jesus entered triumphantly into jerusalem remember jesus came to celebrate the passover in jerusalem and he was riding on a donkey as is seen in the bible mark matthew you know he rode on the donkey and then while he was coming in there was this shout we were holding palm front shouting hosanna the king of king has arrived well, that's a lady a clothes on the floor shouting hosanna and stuff like that the palm front right particularly signifies victory it signifies conquering all of these things are the symbol you know that the spam front signifies and we commemorate this on palm sunday as well in my church let me pause here and ask do you celebrate palm sunday is this what you do in your church do you celebrate it if you do please let us know in the comment section below let's interact as much as possible i'll come around again okay when something pops up i'll come around again to give more explanations of it please keep watching don't go nowhere love you they set the way for instruction. They want to see how they come for screaming and for everything. That is why the Bible is in some of us. So the message elaborated more on Palm Sunday on why Jesus came in. All of these things were talked about by the priest in this particular message. I'll just let you listen to them. But before I go ahead and I want to ask again, what was preached in your church today? What was the title or the topic of the message you heard today in Palm Sunday? Did you go to church? Did you go to church today? Please let me know in the comments section below. As we go ahead to listen to the priest, please enjoy. Don't go nowhere. God bless you. Jesus entered into Jerusalem and the welcome that in fact was much more than any kind of What is Hosanna? Hosanna means so many things. 
It's a sign of joy, a sign of victory, a sign of salvation. And in Greek meaning of it, it's safe. Several hours later. Another thing that pops up is a cross. So on Palm Sunday, the palm front that you see, many times we use them to make cross that you just saw in the last clip. Uh, we do this um, cross. Sometimes we keep them for the next year to burn as ash for Ash Wednesday. But for some time now, we've not done that. But most churches, that is what they do. They keep their farm fronts for the following year. They burn them and use them on Ash Wednesday. So here I was trying to show you how we make a curse on this day. You just bend the palm front tree or leaf into the shapes that you see. And then you cross them around with the palm fronts as well. All right, please keep rushing and don't go nowhere. Catch ya later. Love ya. So, see, happy Palm Sunday. Happy Palm Sunday. Freaky, freaky. If you blow your kisses. No. <laughs> I cited a couple of persons who were dancing during Palm Sunday and Joshua was outside playing as usual. I just thought to capture all of this, you know, for Palm Sunday. All of this will make up my video, Sha. Please keep watching. Don't go nowhere. Thank you. Love you. Happy, happy Palm Sunday. Thank you. Happy Palm Sunday. Happy Palm Sunday.